Welcome back. Now at 5.30, a Miami Beach man who struggled with fear and depression during COVID shutdowns found inspiration in his neighborhood while walking every day at dawn. He has now helped others who suffered with the same conditions and has even created a side art business from it. CBS Force Lisa Petrillo is walking with Wiley. How blessed are we? Every day we get to see this. I mean, and I took it for granted. Mark Wiley, who's worked for the Best Buddies organization for more than 30 years advocating for disability rights, has been doing a lot of walking around his Miami Beach neighborhood. 485 days today that I've been walking consistently. Happy Sunday. I was just thinking about time. It all started when COVID shutdowns began. As a gay, single black man, he said he felt alone and scared. George Floyd had just been murdered. The uh, COVID had just hit hard. I'm sitting in my apartment and, you know, I'm working from home and I'm alone, you know, I, and I just felt like I was caged. Uh, my message for the day is being grateful. And so one day before dawn, he got out and started walking and discovered things he'd never noticed before. I would walk further and further every day and I discovered the beach and I started writing things that are, you know, believe and kindness. He would get to the beach just before sunrise, write a positive thought in the sand, take a photo of it and post it. Soon his mantra, hashtag walk with Wiley was born. It's amazing how many people that I've met that really embrace the mornings and they're very spiritual about it, but it's also a very cleansing and a way to recharge and reconnect with oneself. The new Wiley. Mark, who back in 2006 lost more than 120 pounds on the TV show The Biggest Loser, has always struggled with his weight, and the walking has helped him in many ways. I always find that every day with walking is like a little bit of a victory, and I find that when I'm able to get out in the morning, I'm able to carry that with me throughout the day. Now Mark has turned that victory into a business. He's created hashtag Walk with Wiley greeting cards, now for sale on his website. I did a limited uh, edition of a Miami Beach collection that's out, and I just got my holiday cards yesterday. And so as we both write our meaningful messages in the sand, Mark honors mine. If it pays tribute and honor to your family, that means a lot to you. Perfect. And as the sea washes our messages away, Mark says that's all good too. It's, it's like a reset. cleansing. And it's like, you know, we get to do this every day. And I always write, you know, a new day reset. Love that. Love that. Yeah. Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. Love the messages. You can check out Mark's work in person next week. He's showing his beach cards and acrylics during Art Week in Le Art Noir Diversity in Color Exhibition at the African Heritage Cultural Arts Center in Miami. It runs through December 3rd through the 5th.